I'm Joe Biden. His full name is Joseph Robin Nett Biden Jr. He was a famous president-elect of the United States. He was born on November 20, 1942, in Scranton, Pennsylvania, United States. His father's name was Joseph R. Biden SR and his mother's name was Catherine Eugenia Finnegan. Joe Biden is the president-elect of the United States and will become the 46th president when he will assume the charge on January 20, 2021. Biden is the is the oldest person ever elected to the White House. He served as the 47th vice president of the United States from 2009 to 2017. Before becoming the vice president, he had represented Delaware as a United States senator from 1973 to 2009. Born in a middle-class family in Pennsylvania, United States, Joe Biden learned the value of hard work, determination and perseverance from his parents who always encouraged him to stand up for himself and bounce back after failures. As a child, he used to stammer, but he overcame this problem by memorizing and reciting long passages in front of the mirror. He went on to study law and also developed interest in politics. Joseph Robinette Joe Biden, Sr. is the eldest of their four children. He was raised a Catholic. His father was a used car salesman who also cleaned furnaces for extra income. In 1961, he attended the Archmere Academy in Claymont and graduated. He was a mediocre student, but displayed exceptional leadership qualities from a young age, and was elected the class president during his junior and senior years. He was also a talented football player. He then went to the University of Delaware, where he studied history and political science and continued playing football. During his initial years in college, he was more interested in socializing and having fun than he was in academics. He fell in love with a girl while in college and this spurred him to become more serious about life. He started working hard and was accepted into the Syracuse University Law School upon in 1965 his graduation from the University of Delaware. He got married the next year while still a student. In 1968, he graduated from law school. He moved to Delaware to embark on a legal career and began practicing at a law firm. During this time he also became active on the political scenario as a member of the Democratic Party and in 1970 he was elected to the Newcastle County Council. In 1972, he ran for the United States Senate as a representative of Delaware against the Republican incumbent J. Caleb Boggs and won the election. At 29, he was the fifth youngest U.S. Senator elected in the nation's history. A devastating tragedy struck the young man when his wife and children became the victims of a terrible automobile accident. His wife and daughter died while his two sons were badly injured. Biden was grief-stricken. Yet he took the oath of office on January 5, 1973. The next few years were very difficult for him as he had to manage his political career along with his responsibilities as a single parent to his boys. In spite of his personal tragedies, he fulfilled his political duties diligently and gained the respect of his colleagues. Over the next few years he established himself as a hard-working and ambitious politician. As the senator he formulated several foreign and domestic policies and served as chairman of the Committee on Foreign Relations for several years, gaining acclaim as one of the Senate's leading experts on foreign policy. In addition to foreign policy, Biden played a pivotal role in issues regarding criminal justice and drug policy. He served on the Committee on the Judiciary and chaired the committee from 1987 to 1995. He was also was a member of the International Narcotics Control Caucus. In 1988, Biden had one son successfully pursue the Democratic presidential nomination. Two decades later in 2007, he once again declared his candidacy for president. However, he did not gain much support and dropped out of the race. The Democratic presidential nominee Barack Obama had cordial relations with Biden and respected him for his years of political experience. He selected Biden to be his running mate in 2008 United States presidential election. The Obama-Biden ticket won the election. 
In 2009, Obama was sworn in as the 44th United States President and Biden assumed office as the 47th Vice President. With his long years of experience as a senator, Biden played a major role in helping the president stabilize the American economy in the wake of the global economic recession. In 2012, the Democrats Obama and Biden proved to be very popular among the citizens in their respective positions as the president and vice president and were easily re-elected to a second term. In his second term, Biden was chosen by Obama to head the gun violence task force, and he drafted certain actions that the president could take for reducing gun violence. In April 2019, Joe Biden announced his bid for the candidacy of the Democratic presidential nominee for 2020 election. He beat rivals Kamala Harris and Bernie Sanders to win the Democratic Party's ticket for the 2020 presidential election. On August 11, 2020 Joe Biden picked Kamala Harris as his running mate for the 2020 election. Joe Biden defeated incumbent Donald Trump in a bitterly fought election and will be inaugurated as the 46th President of the United States on January 20, 2021. Joe Biden served as the senator from Delaware for 36 years during which he established himself as an expert in United States foreign policy. On the domestic front he is famous for his work on criminal justice issues, especially the 1994 Crime Law and the Violence Against Women Act. Assuming office as the vice president at the time when the nation was reeling under the effects of a global recession Biden was entrusted with the responsibility of implementing and overseeing the American Recovery and Reinvestment Act, which has helped to rebuild the United States economy. Joe Biden has received honorary degrees from several prestigious institutions including University of Scranton 1976, St. Joseph's University 1981, Widener University School of Law 2000, Emerson College 2003, and University of Delaware 2004. In 2005, he received the George Aarons Pioneer Medal, Syracuse's highest alumni award for excellence in public affairs. Biden received the Golden Medal of Freedom Award from Kosovo in 2009 for his vocal support for their independence in the late 1990s. While at college he fell in love with Nelia Hunter and married her on August 27, 1966, while still a law student. The couple had two sons and one daughter. In 1972, Nelia and their daughter died in a tragic accident, leaving behind a grief-stricken Biden to care for the surviving children. In 1975, Biden met Gil Tracy Jacobs, who gave a new meaning to his life. In 1977, the couple eventually fell in love and got married. The couple has one daughter. Tragedy again struck Joe Biden on May 30, 2015, when his son Beau Biden died of brain cancer at the age of 46. Joe Biden said, Failure at some point in your life is inevitable, but giving up is unforgivable.